Well, this Arctic air mass has had its way with us over the past week plus across the capital region, the northeast and really most of the country. But starting today, that will start to ease up and we'll start a gradual trend of thawing things out as we work through this final full week of January. As we work through the next several days, little by little, that cold air gets pushed back into Canada and eventually something much milder will be building in from the south and west. We'll be talking more about where those temperatures go here as we look towards your seven day in just a moment. But still, starting off this morning, skies are mainly clear. Temperatures very cold. Many of us single digits, even lower teens to kick off your Monday. Live view in Amsterdam with our Housing Authority building. Cam, things are nice and quiet. Just a handful of cars working through the Mohawk Valley this morning. As we look at the big picture, still have high pressure to our south, and of course, plenty of cold air hanging in across the northeast. But back towards the west, as we move from this transition of the Arctic air to something a little bit milder, will be a couple of disturbances that could lead to some messy conditions. In fact, parts of the plains and the Mississippi Valley waking up to an ice storm this morning, and we'll start to see a little bit more of that mixing, some of that moisture drawing closer to us as we continue through the middle part of this week. So for the time being, we're just going to see an uptick in cloud cover as we work through the day. Temperatures still right around freezing this afternoon and into the evening hours, so I wouldn't be surprised. If there are some straight flurries this evening. Then looking towards tomorrow, we wake up with the clouds, but we will be dry as we go through the afternoon. A little bit of moisture starts to build in snow for most, but maybe a brief period of some cold rain in mixing into valley locations. We're going to keep things on the snowy side, at least some very minor accumulations through the start of the day on Wednesday. Temperatures will take another step up, so we start to see more mixing, more rain taking over across the area by Thursday and Friday. Temperatures will be too warm for anything but rain as we can uh, carry on through this week. Right now, just a single degree as we check into North Creek. That is the cold spot. It's four in Bennington. We have 14. Meanwhile, here in Albany, mid teens for your actual temperature in Cobleskill and Pittsfield as we gear up for the day. As we work through this Monday, we are finally thawing out a high of 33 despite increasing clouds. Clouds will help us out tonight, not nowhere near as cold. We had highs around 28 during this most recent stretch, so uh, that's going to feel pretty different waking up tomorrow. Still, a few flurries are expected through this evening. Tomorrow, light snow, that brief period of mixing on the way into the afternoon. As temperatures keep on rising through the 30s, we'll see more rain taking over by Wednesday. It's going to be an off and on setup when it comes with this precip that will extend through Friday morning by the afternoon. As we cap off the week, highs can be around 50 degrees and we'll keep it nice and mild with highs in the 40s straight through the weekend. All right. Thank you, Jill.